Well, Danny Flynn, uh, the, the Russian has arrived. Yeah, he's, um, he's a bright young guy and his English is good. Um, and we're really excited about getting him you know, here in Moncton, but we have to also temper that with the fact that we still have to, to try and get a release for him from uh, via the, the Russian Ice Hockey Federation. So there's still some work to be done and, and uh, we've got our fingers crossed. Now you've got two what appears to be very good Euros, uh, possible Wildcats for the season. Yeah, no question. Like I said, Merrick Rivick came in and he was kind of under the radar for, for a lot of people, but I, I went to Fargo and, and saw both these guys play and Merrick Rivick is, is a very good player and I think people will come to appreciate him in his own right very, very quickly. And again, Kirill Kavanaugh, there's still a lot of you know work to be done as far as his release and we can't get too far ahead of, of ourselves, but if, if he ends up here in Moncton, he's going to be a great addition to the Wildcats and to the league. Well, well, we'll look forward to that. Horrific already has, has uh, shown that he's, uh, he's a terrific young hockey player. Uh, and we mentioned uh, before, he looks like he's got a great shot, and, and uh, in a couple of practices, he's fitted in well. Yeah, I mean, we're going to put him in both games this weekend and start the adjustment in North American hockey, but he's big and strong and, and good puck skills and, and, and good skater, so we're really, uh, really optimistic that uh, he's going to be a very good player, and he's an 18-year-old and, you know, eligible for two seasons, which is real nice. These two were, were clowning it up all already uh, and Horrific uh, was saying to Kavanaugh, hey I'll get you in top shape. Yeah yeah you know what it's uh, uh, kind of neat to see a Slovak and a Russian uh, chirp at each other in English and uh, <laughs> uh, that's the great thing about this game you know it can take people from 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 all four corners of the planet and pull them together pretty quickly so hopefully we can make it all work and, and uh, if we do you know this has potential to be the best two European the best European pair we've had here since since Carson and Bartulis. Uh, no question about that so, okay thanks Danny. I appreciate it thank you. We, we want to know, uh, first of all, how it feels to be finally in Moncton? Uh, it's pretty good. I like the city. I tried to win the Memorial Cup for Wildcats. It's funny that I come here. I like the city. I saw, you know, on Google Maps I saw <laughs> photos with the city. I really like it and it's near the ocean. Maybe someday I'll go there. <laughs> We'll, we'll make sure you get to the ocean. You can rest on that. Uh, have you had a chance to do any any uh, preparation, any skating, or anything while you were in New York? Yeah, I have. I have training. I have practiced with uh, John. I forgot his Jen El Pedro. He's working with some NHL stars in a workout. Um, some practice with New York Islanders and uh, with Russian coach uh, Alexei. Alexei, I forgot his surname, sorry, <laughs> sorry. Nikiforov. Nikiforov, yeah, 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 yeah. He's, very, he's, he's, he's a really good guy, yeah, I like him. So you're, you're uh, itching to get going and, and uh, get your skates on here in Moncton? Yeah, of course I want, I want to try, I want to know the team. Uh, it's really cool that I come here, I want to play for you, I want to get Memorial Cup, <laughs> that's it, that's it? okay, we'll, we'll win there, okay? <laughs>